For many fans, Terminator 2 Judgment Day is a strong sequel. Due to the rest of the franchise, it stands out as being one of the best Terminator films. Interestingly, a few days ago, it was announced that scientists at the Army and Texas AM University have developed a new type of material that has the ability to automatically heal. This immediately reminded many of the T-1000 from Terminator 2. This new technology is noted as being the first of its kind. The scientists have said the materials will likely be used in future military platforms. Frank Guardia, who's an aerospace engineer, is known for his work in the US Army's combat capabilities. Army officials have said they're trying to look to the future, and that there's a possibility this new technology could be used for air and ground missions. Frank Guardia said the following about the materials. We want a system of materials to simultaneously provide structure, sensing and response. Most crosslink materials, especially those that are 3D printed, tend to have a fixed form, meaning that once you manufacture your parts, the materials cannot be reprocessed or melted. This new material is noted as being able to go from a solid to a liquid several times, and that due to its memory behavior, a certain shape can be programmed into it, allowing it to transform back into its preferred shape. As of right now, the researchers have said it's still in its early stages, but the testing has shown this could soon become a reality and could be implemented into the military's arsenal. Interestingly, it's also been announced by the military that they're working on technology to create phantom aircrafts. The US Navy has patented technology to create these images, and it's thought they will be created with infrared technology. One of the issues that the military has faced is being able to protect military aircrafts from enemy missiles. Various ideas have been put forward in the past, and although some have helped, none have been able to stop these attacks. The system has been described as the following. There can be multiple laser systems mounted on the back of air vehicles, with each laser system generating a ghost image, so that it gives off the idea there would be multiple aircrafts present. Interestingly, this has caused some to suggest that the US has already been using this tank, and that this could be behind some of the UFO sightings that have been reported in recent years. It's also been announced that the US Army is going forward with plans to create an extremely powerful laser weapon. The indirect fire protection capability high energy is said to be a 300 upward kilowatt weapon. It's interesting to note that at this moment in time the United States Navy is currently using this tank. However, the laser weapon they use is nowhere near as powerful as this one that's in development. In fact, it's reported that this new laser weapon will be over 10 times more powerful than the one the United States Navy uses. So what do you make of this new material that's able to go from a solid to a liquid several times? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below, and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.